Hey, hi. How are you? This is going to be your lesson for piano for today. So we're talking about two things. We're talking about, well, actually several things. Tempo, the time, how fast or slow I'm playing. Usually you play a slow song that has a one. A love song, the tempo, T-E-M-P-O, and I can write all these things so you can look them up as well. We have in music, we need to know how fast or slow uh, a piece of music usually is. So, in the sheet, I want you to look up some words, tempo. So, a lot of songs have a BPM, or that means beats per minute. So, right here, this number right here on your screen on the screen above the Rhapsody 2 label is our tempo 120 feet and it sounds like this each click is getting essentially a quarter note okay so that means that there's a 120 quarter notes in a minute so that's pretty fast right uh and we're doing so 60 seconds in a minute, 120, so every second you're getting two beats, okay? That's how we divide that. So you have a lot of songs, you have a lot of dance songs, you have... Uh, right, so tempo, how fast or slow? Okay, how fast or slow, and then we use BPM, which is labeled here, it's 120, as your beats per minute. We also have beats per meter, which is our uh, time signature. And that's found usually in uh, on a piece of music that's labeled as a time signature. Real quick, we're gonna talk about the descending bass line. So tempo, dynamics, uh, also loud and soft, right? You have something that's loud. Uh, I'm Descending bass line. So right now I'm in the middle C. I'm gonna label it some. Sometimes you can't really see bass because you can't see how high up I am. But remember where the logo is or where the name of the device is is usually in the center. So right here is what we call the descending bass line. I'm playing in octaves in my left hand. Right? So this is what we call, I'm in the key of C. C, E, and G. I'm going to be using the first, the fourth, F, and the fifth degree of the scale, right? So that's what we're doing. It's a basic progression of a lot of hymns, a lot of music, okay? It sounds better than going like. So that's my progression right now. It's a one, four, five, six. And then go to one, four, five, seven, to six, right? So what does it mean? One, four, five, six. This is the degree. C, F, G, A. So my descending bass line. So I'm going to one, four, So my bass line, I can go four, five, and six. So my bass line can actually keep going. Now this would be a part of the key because my fourth or F major has F, A, and C in it. So I can use this bass line, it'll be F over A. G will have the root, and then A here again. So here we have C, I'm using my inversions in my right hand so that I can see I can um, move around my voice leading so here one 
four, five, six, one, F four, five, and then one. So you have a C. We do the whole then you can actually do that. So we'll talk about that more next time. Have a great one.